Hi, welcome to Science Co. Love, and for today's lesson, we are going to discuss the topic about volcano. For our learning competency, we will discuss the different types of volcanoes and volcanic eruption. Kaya tara let's at ihanda na ang inyong sarili. But first, what is volcano? Volcano is vent in the Earth's crust from which materials such as molten rocks and steam are ejected. So next question is, where does the word volcano came from? Saan nagmula ang salitang vulcan? Ang salitang volcano ay mula sa Roman mythology na Roman god of fire na si Vulcan. Pinaniniwalaan ng mga Roman na kapag nagalit si Vulcan, ay maaaring bumutok ang vulkan kahit anumang oras. Kaya sinusubukan nila lahat ng kanilang makakaya para ma-please o huwag magalit ang God of Fire na si Vulcan. Now, discuss naman natin ang different classification of volcanoes based on behavior. Nakaklassify ang mga vulkan sa dalawa. First, active Second is inactive. Unahin natin yung active volcanoes. What is active volcanoes? Active volcanoes are volcanoes that have erupted within last 600 years. This type of volcanoes are expected to erupt in the future. Actually, we have approximately 1,500 active volcanoes in the world. At base sa Philippine Institute of Volcanologies and Seismology, the country's government agency that deals with volcanic activities and earthquakes, meron tayong 23 active volcanoes. Ang example nito ay Mayon Volcano, Taal Volcano, Bulusan Volcano, at Canlaon Volcano na matatagpuan sa Pilipinas. At about more than 300 named and unnamed inactive volcanoes found in the different parts of Philippine archipelago. Kaya ang Philippines ay considered as one of the countries with many volcanoes and gigantic volcanic eruptions. Ito ay dahil ang Pilipinas ay nasa Pacific Ring of Fire, katulad ng nakikita nyo sa larawan. Ito ang region na may mataas na seismic and volcanic activities. At ang archipelago ng Pilipinas ay surrounded ng plates or slab of solid rocks kung saan nabubuo ang mga vulkan. Next classification is inactive volcanoes. Inactive volcanoes are volcanoes with no record of eruption. Sila yung mga volcano na wala pang record ng pagputok. Ang volcano ay may three categorical stages according to volcanologist. First is active volcano. A volcano that is recently erupted, ito yung vulkan na madalas pumuputok at may possibility pang pumutok sa future. Second is Dormant Volcano A dormant volcano is one that has not erupted for a long time. Ito yung vulkan na napakatagal nang hindi pumuputok. Pero may possibility pa rin pumutok sa future. Ang example nito ay ang Mount Fuji sa Japan. Third and the last is Extinct Volcano. Extinct Volcano is one which has erupted thousand years ago. Vulkan na matagal na sumabok at hindi na muling sasabog pa dahil naubos na supply ng magma. Ito ang extinct volcano. Basic parts of volcano. First is magma reservoir. A large underground pool of liquid rock found beneath the surface of the earth. Dito nagmumula ang magma. Next is trough. The entrance of a volcano. It ejects lava and volcanic ash. Next is conduit pipe, an underground passage 
which magma traveled through. Next is crater, the mouth of volcano. Next part is vent, an opening in the earth surface. Next and the last is ash cloud, a cloud of ash formed by volcanic explosions. Basic types of volcano. First is shield volcano, a type of volcano with broad summit area. Para siyang itsurang warrior's shield dahil malapat ang kanyang summit at malawak ang kanyang area. Example are Kilauea and Mauna Loa in Hawaii, the world's largest volcano in terms of volume and area covered. Second type of volcano is cinder cone, a steep conical hill of volcanic debris deposited around the volcanic vent. Ito yung smallest type ng vulcan. Example is Cerro Negro, a volcano in Nicaragua, na may taas na 728 meters lang. Third and the last is Composite Volcano, or known as Strato Volcano, a tall and conical volcano built up by several strata or layers of eruptive materials or volcanic debris. Example neto ay Mayon Volcano and Mount Fuji in Japan. Now let's move on to the volcanic eruption or the eruptive styles of volcano. We have five types of eruptive styles of volcano. First is phreatic or hydrothermal eruption. It's a steam-driven eruption as the hot rocks come in contact with water. Second is phreatomagmatic. It's a violent eruption due to the contact between water and magma. Third is Strombolian eruption, a periodic quick to violent eruption characterized by fountain lava. Fourth, Volcanian. A Volcanian is characterized by tall eruption columns that reach up up to 20 km high with pyroclastic flow and ash pole. Fifth and the last is Plinian, an excessively explosive type of eruption of gas and pyroclastic material. And that's all. Thank you. See you on our next lesson. Thank you and bye-bye.